The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. Don't be thrown off if your variable, in this case b, appears on the right side of the equation. To solve for b, just follow the same steps that you used in the previous example. First, isolate the term containing b, which in this case is b over negative 3. To isolate b over negative 3, we must get rid of this minus 6. And we do that by adding 6 to both sides of the equation. On the left, negative 7 plus 6 simplifies to negative 1. On the right, our negative 6 plus 6 cancels, and we're left with b over negative 3. To get b by itself, since b is being divided by negative 3, we just multiply both sides of the equation by negative 3. On the left, negative 3 times negative 1 is positive 3. And on the right, our negative 3's cancel, we're left with b. So positive 3 equals b. And we can check our answer by plugging positive 3 back into the original equation for b. And we get negative 7 equals positive 3 over negative 3, which is negative 1, minus 6. So negative 7 equals negative 1 minus 6, which works. So we know our answer is right.